Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Tomba. Last time we left off... I don't remember. It's been a while since I've been recording. So, let us see what we are up to. I know I did some grinding to get the gems. That I remember. Most pig bag, I still have to go back for that. Dormy pig bag, I still have to get, and I know where that is. Okay. So yeah, I did miss a few things from just because I've been playing from memory. So first, let me see stats. Oh, frig, my ear is itchy. Okay, so yeah, I've maxed out wind and fire. Water is definitely going to be the difficult one to max out. Uh, there we go. <laughs> uh, definitely been a while if I can't remember the controls. Okay. So first thing, we want to grab that fire gem. <laughs> and <laughs> I did get a comment pointing out that <laughs> I cannot speak to save my life. <laughs> Pretty much mentioning how I accidentally called something something out. Um, something in the Haunted Mansion is this the Haunted Mansion. <laughs> I have pretty much meant to say, is this the entrance I need in the Haunted Mansion? But again, my English is horrible, speaking I know two other languages, sorta. <laughs> other than English, and it's like, blah, blah. Red Hidden Powers is now clear. The moment you max out your level for the fire, you can obtain that gem. <sighs> okay, so that is done. Our next stop, if I went the right way, <laughs> is... Come on, go the right way, Tomba. <laughs> Buckus Village. <laughs> I knew I'd remember the name eventually. So back to Buckus Village we go. Over. And... Do -do 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 -do. If you are wondering about Tomba being black and white the entire game, don't worry, it is not permanent. Um, when you first get it and you do die, it'll go away, but there is an item also that you can get that gets rid of it. Hi, you really have <laughs> I cannot speak <laughs> to save my life at all. You've really helped us. If we were bigger, we'd be able to do it ourselves, but it's those darn evil pigs. If only the spell was broken, our original bodies would be restored. Oh, by the way, I put a treasure chest next to the town hall. You can have it if you'd like. But I'm afraid I don't know how to open it. Believe it or not, <laughs> this is the chest with the Buckus Village pig bag. I can't believe I forgot about this. It just goes to show how much RPG elements are in this game. The mouse pig bag is now clear. Next, Buckus Village. And don't worry, I do remember where the orange pig bag, or orange evil pig is. Oh yeah, yeah. Me English good now. <laughs> okay, so our next stop is Phoenix Mountain. As of this recording, I have been to Kelowna to see the school I'm going to, and it's amazing what they offer there. I was super excited for it. Come up. Ah. Fine, do it this way. And run into another coma pig, of course. Get you. Get rid of you. Wasn't expecting that. Oh, and a lunchbox. <laughs> It's pretty deadly to be running up here, especially equipped with the funky parasol equipped. The winds are nasty. Now, if you want an easy way to get... Oops. <laughs> easy way to get your uh, water experience to max, you can farm it off of these guys. You swing your boomerang on them, and they are counted as the water experience. I'm not going to do it right now, just because I'm currently running like a maniac, and that makes things difficult. Okay, ah, I wasn't expecting you to be there. See? Water. 
Okay, I didn't think that one through. I need the flunky parasol this time. So we're going back down. Doop -doo. And spit. <laughs> Ignoring you. Getting back up here. Doo -doo and equipping the funky parasol to get the range I need. Sort. And. Okay. There we go. Now I can unequip it. There. Okay. Can't open that chest yet, but we can open this one. Which has the dashing pants. Very handy. Then we drop down here and go in here. And the Readyville pig bag is in here. Next stop is back to the jungle. Oh, that was a lucky jump! I pretty much did a blind leap of fate there. Okay. And you know what? Instead of doing this, I could easily just use Baron and get back. What am I thinking? Honestly, you aren't actually supposed to have Baron until you return from the jungle properly, but again, I couldn't remember how. And you had the charity wings on you, so it wasn't a big deal. So, we are going into the deep jungle. Actually, let's go to the village of civilization. That'll make things easier. At the Y crossing. Use the Baron! <laughs> I never even noticed that using it! Wow! Him, I should say. Okay, it's so over this way. And we want to talk to this guy. Come on. Hmm? Oh, the Iron Castle door? That door is so old. It probably won't open unless you blow it up with a bomb or something. I need a bomb. <laughs> You want me to make a bomb? <laughs> what a gullible little fellow you are. I was just joking. I guess no one has gone t to such lengths to try and open the door. Come to think of it, I do have a bomb. I made it a long time ago, but it's dangerous and I didn't have any use for it. So I hid it in the jungle on the highest tree. It looks like a coconut, but actually it's a really powerful bomb. Even an iron door wouldn't be able to hold up against this bomb. Be real careful though. So yeah, he pretty much told us where it's hidden. And, in the midst of getting that bomb, we can take on the bu uh, evil pig for Buckus Village. So we head on out. <laughs> and up the tallest tree. So the first the door, and second, the bomb! <laughs> Easy as that! And I do have to go back to a certain area to finish the pump rocks. <sighs> but first, evil pig. And what element will he be? Earth. Why, if it isn't just some funny looking kid. Is this some kind of joke? I figured all sorts of big scary people will come to fight me. I can beat anyone here, no matter how many f fight me. Why? Because this place is... is... Uh, uh... I'm not telling you! It's for me to know and you to find out. Find out when I crush you! <laughs> and he is fairly difficult, just because he summons rocks! Ah, oh, dang it! The bag just went up a little too high for me. So let's get up a little higher. Gotcha! <laughs> uh, during my practice, that was a little more difficult than I remember it being, but... There is the orange pig. For Buckus Village. Whew. Returning everyone from Mouse... To human. <laughs> of 
quite nice, right? Huh. That's another one finished. Okay, now let's go give him the use that bomb on the door. Oh, my ears itchy. Itchy. Stop itching. Here we go. <laughs> okay, in we go to the Iron Castle. And we're gonna use the bomb. So, triangle. And bomb. Everyone heads out. I haven't seen that expression for a while. And the iron door has been blown open. Ta da! <laughs> and we head on in. And if I'm remembering right, this is all pre rendered. Yeah, I'm not even touching the controller, and Tom is moving on his own. I'm gonna sneeze. Ha! <coughs> uh, excuse me. But now everything's working again, and back in this area, we can see what that is. We need power is now clear. <laughs> well, I sure do owe you a favor. Say, I hear that you're traveling in search of the evil pigs. Wait right here, okay? I heard that a 10,000 year old man who lives near the large pool at the top of the waterfall knows all about the evil pigs. Why don't you pay him a visit? You'll need to go through the village of all beginnings to get to the top of the waterfall. The detour is a pain in the neck, but good luck! The 10,000 year old man. The door to the old pond is locked. Here, take this. It's the key to the door at the old pond. Now we get the key to the old pond. Ride the raft from the hill with the old tree to return to the haunted mansion. I'll leave the raft at the factory so you can go ahead and take it. Let's ride the raft. This is actually the way you're supposed to leave the jungle, but <laughs> charity wings, you usually have a lot of them. So you can travel back. And nothing else in the castle now to do. For now. <laughs> I'll leave you guys guessing on that one. Oh, um, if there is anybody who has played ahead. Uh, please don't post any spoilers in the comments. This is one of the games where I kind of want people to figure it out on their own. Listen, I just came back from the village of all beginnings. While I was there, I saw her. The witch! Her name is Mizuno, and well, she's really cute. Oh, I wish I could see her again. The cute witch. Oh, my ear. Why are you itching again? It's the other one this time. Sorry if my no voice kind of went all blah 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 on the mic. Um, lifting off the ear earpiece puts the mic in front of my mouth. Don't fall off headset. Okay, so our next stop is at the raft. I am putting the funky parasol back on. This work? Oops, too far. Funky parasol. Music in this game is just awesome. I love it. It captures every area very nicely. Oh no, you don't. I'm not getting captured. And we swim on over. Back to the old tree. And even though it is a little difficult to tell, you can figure out where that little raft uh, port is. I forgot to grab the raft! <laughs> Just a sec, I'll be right back. Okay, sorry about that. I completely forgot to pick up the raft before leaving. What I'll do though is I'll use a charity wing and head back to the old tree. That way you're not waiting, but here's the raft. Raft acquired. Now, let's use a charity wing, since we have plenty of them. Go to the old tree. <laughs> there.
There we go. And I did take some damage on the way back, but you hop down here. It's a little difficult to see, but this is where you go. And you use the raft. Easy as that. Let's ride the raft is now clear. Huh. And the hunt. Well, the mansion now, I guess. And now we should actually be able to go a few places. But first, I'm going to use a lunchbox because I need the health. <laughs> and use you. Don't worry, we won't have 8 vitality for long. Um, where was that one door? Is it this one? I can't quite remember, but I want to take a look anyway. <laughs> you can actually use the Jewel of Fire here in the mansion, I just can't remember which door it is. I think it was on the east? No, south side. This is the north side of the mansion. <laughs> That's the first time I've done that. One of these doors leads somewhere. Is this it? No. We will be back in this door, though. That one leads to the elevator. Oh, I can't drop down from there. Hmm. Where was it? Was it? No, this is the hot spring door. That's the thousand year old man. Was it this door? Huh. No. Hmm. Why can I never remember this place? stuff from behind it. Oh well, I'll worry about it later. Our next stop is the Village of All Beginnings. <laughs> As you can tell, this game does encourage exploration a lot, but they do give you the Charity Wings as well as Baron for a quick shortcut. Uh, do they give you thanks here? I think some of them do. Hmm. Maybe not. I'm probably overthinking things. You know, on the way back, I could actually go and, um, take care of the stormy pig. Red evil pig. Uh, here for Phoenix Mountain. Now, loading. Doop-doop-doop-doop-doop-doop-doop-doop-doop. 